Hey folks, it's Mark and Bob of Fire Mountain Outdoors. Thanks for joining us on this beautiful February day in the beautiful Pacific Northwest. Hey, we just got back from SHOT Show a couple of weeks ago and we saw this very, very cool thing. Uh, this is the Universal Optics Adapter, the hookups from Carson. Uh, I saw a demonstration of what this was and I thought it was really cool. Yeah, you can take any smartphone and you can hook it up to your optics using this adapter. Very sweet product. Stick around, we're gonna show you the unboxing and what this thing can do. Well, let's open this thing up, Bob. You know, these fine folks at Carson, we they were gracious enough to send us two sets of these. I've already opened mine up and I've been playing with it, and I love what this thing can do. So do I. I was really impressed with it. I was also impressed with the packaging when you opened yours up. So uh, it's nicely sealed in some plastic. It's got uh, it's got a, a very attractive box, which would help promote point of point of. Uh, sale purchases the box it, it kind of reminded me of opening an iphone that's what it reminded me it's, of also it's it's, kind of, it's got a nice right box within a box designed by carson in new york inside this very nice case that keeps it padded and protected it's form fitted so you can keep this in your truck or in your toolbox or wherever you're going to have it and it's padded and protected and it's free from getting dirt french fries and dust and uh vehicle detrius all jammed up in it That's right. so here on the instructions they give you a, a link to their authorized tutorial video on how to install it uh, i've read the read the directions and i'm just gonna mount it up right quick Basically, what you don't want to do is, is have it crooked or not parallel. So what we're trying to do is line up the, the lens of the camera in the center of that peak hole right there. cool thing is once you get it set up for your phone then you don't have to adjust it every time you just put it in there and there so now I have my lens is centered in the uh, in the eye hole and my phone is parallel this way and it's true there so now let's mount it up on an optic so with my phone I'm using the iPhone 6 and it works really well with this setup you can see here we've got the lens exposed there and with these tension tabs right here that's how you attach that to your to your binoculars or your scope whatever you're using I had the Magpul case protector on my iPhone I found that it works better without it I did get it to work with it, it just seems to be a little bit more clear without it they also include if you have a phone that has a small lens like you have on the iPhones here this adapter right here and that fits right over the top now you can attach that to your optic and then that's how that's going to work works really well and then we can adjust what we're seeing there so it hooks up real nice and easy we're going to give this a try we're going to put this on a spotting scope and see how it works with that one of the most exciting things for me about this product is the ability to take your eye away from the optic and share it with your buddy. So right here I have my spotting scope set up on a window mount and I am able to look through the spot and scope and so is Eli. We can both see that. So if I'm looking at a, at a monster buck, I can share it with him right here. I don't have to, you don't have to get his binoculars out and look and, uh, you know, the old uh, uh, by the tree or by the stump and to the left, I can't see it kind of a thing. Look, I can point right there. I can zoom in and out with, with, uh, with the camera. I can, I can zoom out. Um, 
it's just super slick that way being able to to share and you don't get that 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 pirate eye from <laughs> looking through a spot scope for hours and hours and hours you can just sit there look at it pan and scan look at everything you want and you also have the ability to zoom in right on the phone that it's very very cool in that regard hey one of the other cool features and and cool points about having a optics adapter for your smartphone like this is right here at the firing range bob uh, it, we have our 100-yard target set up. That's right. And we have put the phone on our optics adapter, on our spotting scope, and we have a clear view of our target. So we can see our hits uh, right from the bench without having to shift, adjust, squint, move. You know, there's, a, there's some bazillion-dollar uh, accessories that you can buy to see your targets with this adapter you can just use your phone that you already have you already have the technology and you have the optics you just need to marry the two pieces together that's right and uh so this is going to give a great way you can film bullet impacts happening you can have your buddy sitting here that uh, may have a hard time looking through you know an optic like this but mm -hmm. now they can see and they can call out the shots as you're firing if you're unable sure. to see it if you're using open sights or something Long Okay, you are, uh, your elevation's great. You're to the right, about uh, three inches outside of the ball. My uh, long range shooters can record their, their hits. Yeah. Uh, you see the bullet traces, see the hits on the steel. Look, wow. No. Thousand, it's recording uh, uh, audio at the same time. It's cool stuff. Yeah, it is. Yeah. So this is actually going to be useful for us for actually filming and recording because we are staying uh, held just right in the landscape mode. So it depends on your eyepiece. Uh, Bob had uh, the Swarovskis have a have a small bearing surface and, and it wouldn't stay in landscape but stayed just fine in portrait. And uh, on this old uh, optic that I had here, I removed the rubber cup and, and tried to just use it on there and it didn't work. But on this bush now, it does. So depending on what your eyepiece is, it very well may stay in the uh, landscape mode and you can film proper. Well, Bob, we have the Hookups Universal uh, Smartphone Adapter for the optics here. I think it's a great tool. I think it's a very good tool. You know, we were able to use it, uh, you know, panning and scanning, you know, the hillsides. You know, we can look at our targets at 100 yards, mm -hmm. call the shots. And uh, so if somebody doesn't have a, you know, a steady enough hand to use some binoculars or they're using a spotting scope, you can record your bullet hits. You can record wildlife. There's a lot of possibilities with this unit. There is. I think it's. I think it's a. It's a great addition uh, for a nominal price. If nothing else, during scouting season, being able to get rid of pirate eye, you know, <laughs> having to squint and squint and keep one eye shut for hours and hours on a spot scope, that in itself is huge. Uh, being able to take pictures of the moon. You know, you take a smartphone picture of the moon. It's like epic, big giant moon, and then <laughs> and you get a picture. It's just just a dot. It's like oh, I saw awesomeness. Maybe I can walk an extra ten feet to get closer. Right? Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't work. Yeah, it doesn't work. Uh, I can see just uh, tons of great uses for this. Uh, photographing wildlife, photographing the moon, taking pictures of uh, the the neighbor's illegal campfire or whatever. <laughs> Figuring out what Eli's doing at the bottom of the property. Yeah. Exactly. No, it's a, a for a nominal price, uh, well packaged, great package, great protective piece that you can put in your range bag. Mm -hmm. It's got a carabiner so you can hook it up to your backpack. Right. And it's always accessible and usable. I think it's a great item, and uh, I, I'm glad that we have a couple here at Firearm Mountain Outdoors. Yeah, it's a worthy addition. So go check out uh, the Carson hookups. Uh, it's a it's a great product. Like I said, I had one caveat with it not staying landscape. That's really a function of the optic, not not the hookup. Uh, so it worked well on my Bushnell, didn't work on the other. Uh, so I, I'm happy now. I go, okay, well, I can I can, I can, can make them work with on the Bushnell. Way. Absolutely. Right. So uh, great product. We like it. Yes. So big, two big thumbs up from Fire Mountain Outdoors. If you like what you saw here today, make sure you like and subscribe and make sure you check out Carson. 
and their uh, their cell phone grabby thing. Thanks for watching. Thank you.